Andy progression to the next round, 3-0. A routine win. Wickham caused a few problems, but thought overall on the performance. Yeah, credit to Wickham. Um, caused us a few problems, very direct. Had some very good individual players. And at times we went at the races, we, we certainly didn't play our best football. But the important thing tonight was that we we got minutes on the pitch. Um, delighted we had three academy boys who started the game and played the game, seven in total. Um, it's always nice to win, that's the most important thing. Did we, want a bit, did we want a better performance? Of course we did. We want to play the right way and dominate and play the right type of football. And at times we didn't, we were slow, we were laboured, we gave the ball away a lot, we made a lot of bad decisions, but the positive is there's a lot of first team lads out there tonight, some real quality, who have been given minutes on the pitch. Um, we've progressed to the next round, so that's the most important thing tonight. You mentioned the, the academy players, I think that's probably what you'll focus on the most, obviously being head of academy likes a short who played the full game, Charlie Heinton and, and Harry Pettersson as well in the midfield. Experience for them, it's, it's second and on really, and it'll help them going forward. Of course, exactly right. I mean, if you think these young lads, 18-year-old, 19-year-old, are in a dressing room with National League North players, ex-Football League players, the experience is invaluable. So if you're amongst the warm-up, if you're in the dressing room, if you're playing minutes, those are experiences that you kind of get. Um, and it's vital for those boys to get that, that experience to develop further. And you're playing with the likes of Chris Mason, who I thought was exceptional, like 38-year-old. The back four was a makeshift back four, but they dealt with the pressures and the, the physicality of the opposition very well. Um, Say Chris Mason, Sparky, Tommer, Frank Mulhern, I can rhyme all the names off, experienced first team National League players. And I thought the lads, like I say, we didn't play great. It wasn't our best performance. I don't think the fans watching or people coming to watch would have thought, oh, that's a great game. It wasn't. Um, but the important thing tonight was, like I say, get minutes on the pitch, fitness, uh, and to move to the next round. So in terms of, of Niall Short, left back, Harry Peterson, 18 year old, Charlie when he came I thought were fantastic, there's some, some really talented boys in our academy um, and they're training now regular with the first team, with, with the new gaffers and they've got an opportunity, it's a, it's a clean slate, the, the gaffers have been very clear, it's an opportunity for boys and players to show what they're all about, so we've had, some, we had another five on the bench tonight, again equally talented players, so there's seven amongst it tonight, boys training regularly with the first team. Uh, and those lads have got an opportunity just to show what they're all about. But I thought the I thought the three of them did very well tonight, the young boys.